Hey awesome people, my name's Ryan Wilkes. I'm a Canadian travel and adventure filmmaker and photographer. I take adventurous trips fairly often, but nothing compared to my week-long trek to the summit of Mount Kilimanjaro and then paragliding off the summit of that mountain. It was just amazing. Mount Kilimanjaro is located in the East African country of Tanzania. It is the highest mountain in Africa and also the world's tallest freestanding mountain. There were two main purposes for my trip to Tanzania. First of all was obviously to climb the mountain and have an amazing adventure. But more importantly, myself and three friends from New Zealand pledged to raise 25,000 US dollars to build new education facilities for a rural Maasai community in Tanzania so that the children in that community could get access to basic education. The physical preparation for our trek involved training in a simulated altitude chamber where we could artificially decrease the amount of oxygen available for our bodies in the chamber. When we finally got to the summit, it was just the most incredible feeling. We had been planning this trip for well over a year and to see everything to come together and for all of us to make it to the summit safely was just a huge accomplishment. The most unexpected part about the trek for me personally was just the diversity that one mountain has on it from a perspective of climates, landscapes, wildlife even, plants that you see on the trail. You start on the African savanna, you work your way through rainforest, then you just go through all these crazy arid kind of desert landscapes. And then on the summit, there's glaciers. Believe it or not, this was actually my first time ever paragliding. I was on the trip as the filmmaker and photographer and I flew off in a tandem with a much more experienced pilot. It's really hard to put into words how incredible that experience was. For people who have never hiked Kili but would like to in the future, the best advice that I can give you is to take it slow and to just enjoy the mountain. You can do routes up the mountain that take anywhere from three days up to eight days. And so if I were you, I would advise taking one of the longer routes, such as the Machame route, which is the one we took. We took seven days, we took our time, we were able to acclimatize slowly, which really increases your chances of making the summit safely. That was my epic trip to Mount Kilimanjaro.